What up, y'all? Mark Jack 79 here. We are back again tonight, a Wednesday night. A beautiful, chill Wednesday night. Talking about some Marvel Legends, man. We got some uh, new stuff. We got some old stuff. We got some comparisons. Yeah, we got a little bit of a haul here. The main vocal point is going to be the vision here. Comparison. We're going to talk about it. Yeah, then we also picked up this yellow jacket, the Peggy, and uh, the Dora Malaji too. So, I'm going to start it off with the vision here. Um, picked it up from another seller, Loose, from uh, a Facebook Marvel Legends group. 13 bucks plus shipping, so paid about 17 54 in total. Not too shabby. Um, I was just tired of hunting for it, man. I found one that was selling it and went on ahead and picked them up. Not too bad. <clears throat> I don't know. It's a little bit. Uh, eh. uh, we'll get into some more intricate details here, the articulation here shortly. But just, eh, I mean, I guess sure. <laughs> I, I I feel like I was hoping for like a little bit more with this figure, just with the aesthetics or whatnot. I don't really know how I feel about it, man. I God, I don't know. <laughs> Uh, especially compared to the this is the vision that I've had in my collection for like years now at this point he was the Chinese knockoff or whatever and I feel like he did a, a decent job especially being only like 10 bucks and I don't know the the actual uh, figure itself uh, shoot <laughs> uh, yeah but uh, but let's just hit these uh, these extras up here real quick so we got the Peggy and the yellow jacket as uh, together um, bought them from a seller for forty dollars in total for so twenty bucks a piece I thought that was a good a good deal uh, yellow jacket was one of the MCU villains that I wanted in my collection, but just hadn't obtained them yet. And then Peggy just kind of randomly fell in. You know, he just happened to be selling her too, and I just flat out asked him. I was like, "Hey, you know, you wanna you wanna make a deal and send me the Peggy and the Yellow Jacket for forty twenty dollars a piece?" He was like, "Sure, man, that works for me." It's like sweet. So we added Peggy. Uh, Caps a uh, special lady to the collection right now as well. So get a close up on her. I feel like she looks really good. I, I can't think of the actress's name, but <clears throat> I feel like she came out really good. I'm not gonna go through her articulation or anything like like, like that. I just got her in like a standing stoic pose. Here, stockings, action going on there. Shoes, face sculpts beautiful. So yeah, man, really really feel like that came out good. I'm really happy with that. And that actually poses really well with my uh, Civil War uh, the SH figure arts Captain America. Uh, I'll show y'all that once I take everything down to the museum here. And then we have the yellow jacket here. Came out good as well. I'm not going to go through his articulation either because this is an older figure. So I feel like, you know, I mean, if you were interested in this figure, you probably already have it. Or... You know, probably just waiting on it on a good deal for it, like I was. So, looks really good, man. The little uh, ex the the little spear or uh, uh, stingers here is a de is a detachable. Um, he he also came with you know its own little miniature version of the yellow jacket as well. So that was pretty cool. Even though I, I actually already had one in my collection with the numerous Ant Man figures that I got. But he scales really well with the Ant Man and the Yellow Jacket in my collection, so really happy to to add him as well. He was a really cool villain, in my opinion. I think I like Ghost better, but you know, uh, being the original you know movie Ant Man villain it was really cool to add him to the collection. And then you know I was hunting at Walmart today for this what this uh <laughs> bro thor wave and couldn't didn't find anything obviously but i didn't find this door malaje figure for 15 bucks so i went ahead and and picked her up too so i was thinking about army building these well not really army building like i got this one but i kind of wanted another one too so i can put another one of these hep sculpts on so if anybody is selling a door malaje body for cheap like 10 bucks maybe hit me up let's talk let's make a deal you know so but yeah i'm happy to have that in my collection as well <clears throat> we'll uh crack this open here real quick 
Alright, and here's the Dora Milaje out of the package too. Uh, I went with this head sculpt. It was my favorite out of the three. Just a, just a stoic pose. But getting a look at the beautiful outfit here. Very happy with this purchase, man. Probably going to go back to that Walmart to pick up the other one too. Just so I can have two of them. Let's move to the back here real quick. Kind of sucks that they didn't add any like coloring to the back of the outfit here. I guess they got a little bit lazy-ish. But, but the front looks good. I mean, obviously I'm going to be posing her from the front, so... Is what it is, but yeah, happy to have her, man. All right, so let's uh let's set up the stand and let's really turn into this vision here. So head move, rotate 360 degrees, uh, tilt. Nope, no tilt, no tilt. You know you get no tilts. Move downwards that much, upwards that much, but you should get an ugly gap right there. Yeah. Um, and you know a little bit more info about this figure. I know this is retailing at Walmart. I think it's on like a rollback for sixteen eighty eight right now. If you can get lucky and find it, I know GameStop's got it too on pre order for like twenty two twenty or ninety nine. I think so. Yeah, I mean obviously if you can find it at Walmart, I would go that route. But you know, yeah, uh, arm rotate three sixty degrees. Push all the way up this way. As far as for that, as far as it go, all the way back, back down, bicep swivel. See the uh, wrist rotation. Uh, it's weird that he didn't come with any, but he didn't he didn't come with fisted hands though either. Yeah, it's a little weird. Uh, yeah, I don't know, man. I don't know why he didn't come with fisted hands. Uh, so the and I don't even. It looks looking like that. These can these hands come out uh, it's not looking like it because it's on a it's on a, a bar a ball peg so I don't even think these hands can come out yeah that god that's weird uh, shoot like I said man some of these Marvel Legends man they put a lot of effort into it, and then some of them they just half ass to to the extreme dude it's crazy yeah especially like a, it's not like vision is not like a major character either so it's, in, it's insane to me so <laughs> leg can kick out this much Kick backward this much. Standard Marvel, Marvel Legends uh, articulation. Knee, knee joint. Go back that much. Foot, ankle. Here you go. You can be pushed up and down. You can rotate left and left and right, as you can see. Push that back down. Then another weird decision with this. This knee. God, dude, I don't know. This is. Just... This figure's just pissing me off, though. You, you ever just get get a figure, and you're just fooling around with it, and you really just start to, like, it's, it's, he's just rubbing me the wrong way. That's all it is, man. He's really just rubbing me, he's really just rubbing me the wrong way. <laughs> I don't know. It's tough to explain. Um, but the, the cape here, he's got, this is weird, too. It's like they didn't, he's, it, it can peg in from the back here to this little back hole here, as you can see. So, you got Push that in there. If so I can do that on camera. Yeah, like that. And but see when when you do that, this front piece like flips up up though? Okay. <laughs> you see what I'm saying? You see my do you see my issues though? It's like this 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 like this needs to be super glued down or something. This is not supposed to just come up like that. It's not like it's not it's not stand down. Yeah, dude. Sheesh. But you know, it's, it's whatever. I'm I'm happy to have him in my collection. He was a cool character, not my favorite Marvel character, not by not by far. Especially with his predictable death in Infinity War. Uh, there was no way, you know, he was Thanos was going to be able to build the Infinity uh, Gauntlet without the without the Mind Gem. So. And then that let's take a look another look at his body here real quick too oh, something about this this is face man i'm just not liking this face i feel like he was not that it's not the right shade of uh, it's not it's like it's no lining in his face <laughs> no it is driving me nuts Do you, you see how you could at least like see the face indentures in this cross-eyed knockoff uh, i just Man, I just do not understand this design choice. It's, it's like they went with like a translucent body mode. Ah, just Jesus, dude. Like you can see the texture and the print, all that, man. Just I don't, I don't know. I'm just not feeling it. I'm not feeling it at all. 
okay just yeah dude yeah it's, like I said it's, it's, sometimes these figures are really cool then like I'm really happy with these three these are cool I, I love these but you know the newest one that I'm added to the collection dude this is a letdown to the extreme bro yeah yeah man that's, that is a disappointment <laughs> oh alright man let's uh so let's just take this stuff down downstairs and let's add it to the uh, museum all right. so now we got the stuff down in the, mu in the museum so here's our vision uh, right next to our scarlet witch I mean we pose him next to her it doesn't look too bad kinda got him in a pose and he's like looks like, looking like he's about to shoot his mind gym beam so you know not, I mean, we, we post him, he's not bad, man, but just, uh, this, I just still have my issues with him, man. The Dora Milaje figure came out really, really good. Got her pose with the rest of the Black Panther figs. Here, looks, looks good. Looks to the, the Nikita, the Shiri, the T'Challa, T'Chaka. Looks good. And then the yellow jacket is down here with the rest of the MCU villains. Kind of ran out, out of room on the shelf here, but you get the picture. Uh, like that. And then we have our Peggy standing next to our Civil War cap. I feel like they came out really good. I really like that. That's probably my favorite out of the out of the bunch here. So they came out really good. So yeah, man. And with that, it's going to end our video, man. So, as always, I appreciate everybody watching. Uh, you know what to do. Uh, if this, if you like what you saw, do me a favor, hit that like button. Uh, if this video reaches 100 likes, then we, as always, we will do a Marvel Legends giveaway. Yep. <laughs> and speaking of that, yeah, haven't forgotten, man. Still have a sealed, worthy cap. Just waiting on somebody to pick it up. Um, that that video is sitting at 26 likes right now so once it gets another 74 likes I will do that giveaway to a subscriber brand new sealed so yeah man and then like I said if uh, this video gets 100 likes I will do a giveaway of a sealed Mysterio yeah because that's what we do here man if y'all help me out and then I will give back so, alright man, uh, so you can follow me at youtube.com slash smartjack79, I'm also on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter, follow me there as well, and as always, I will see you guys on the next one, I'll catch you guys later, peace.